What's up everyone and welcome back to a new video that we had to make twice already. <laughs> um so today we're gonna be talking about our Milwaukee Brewers twenty twenty one opening day reactions and recap. Um so I was at work when or I only had to wa I only watched two and a thirds of the game, um, because I had to work. And then when I got on my break, we were down five to two in the top of the ninth. I'm like, okay, call it a game. I'm going back in. <laughs> and then I, <laughs> and then I get home, and we won. And I'm like, whoa, 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 wow. <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa! Yeah, we won. <laughs> so that was a great comeback. <laughs> yeah, I agree. You know that. I agree. Um, but before we get into this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe for more content. Because who isn't subscribed? Comment down ideas for future videos and also what you think of this one. And let's get right into it. Um, so, yeah, my reaction was like, wait, we won? Oh, wow, <laughs> cool. What all happened? <laughs> <laughs> um, so, our offense looked really good. Um, we had 11 hits. They had 10. Um, we came back. We won in the 10th inning. That's all history. Um, so... Brandon Woodruff got the start. He kind of got roughed up a little bit to begin. Uh, four innings, six hits, three earned runs, two walks, but five Ks on 78 pitches. Not the best start in the world, but it could have been a lot worse. Um, yeah, he didn't look sharp. But he'll, he'll rebound. He's a star. I think, yeah, he will rebound, definitely. Um... Freddy Peralta, two innings, uh, two hit, or er, yeah, two innings, two hits, three walks, but six strikeouts, fifty-three pitches. Yeah, he, he had some control issues, but he just still did phenomenal. Though otherwise, can't complain. Yeah, Yardley, he went one inning, but he gave up a two-run bomb. Uh, yeah, he's to them. And then oh, Jay, and then oh. uh, a guy that last time I had a hard time pronouncing his last name, so I'm gonna I'm just gonna call him JP. Um, JP went one inning, one walk, two Ks. Uh, Josh Limbloom, one inning, one walk, one strikeout, and then Josh Hader, no hits, three Ks and eleven pitches in the tenth inning. Wow, to power on that one. I was never seen that before. <laughs> yeah. I've never seen that hard before. <laughs> yeah. Hater, dominant as always. Um, offensively, though, Colton Wong looked pretty good. Um, Hira didn't get a hit, but he still got a run in, or he still got, or whatever. Um, Yelich. Hey, uh I believe, though. <laughs> yeah. Yelich he, looked like an MVP. Yeah, Yelich return or looks more like his normal self. Again, that's huge. <laughs> yeah. Um, during the broadcast when I was watching, um, the announcers said that Yelich actually identified the problem from last year, but he didn't identify why he was so bad last year. He's keeping that to himself to make sure that he continues to be better and that nobody knows. Um, but that's good as long as he can, as long as he can bounce back. I don't care. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but so yeah, far, it's working. He dominated in spring training, and so far he's looking really good. <laughs> Two for four, he looked really good. Um, he he hit um the. He hit a really good or a clutch single, even though it did go in and out of Byron Buxton's glove. It almost went out, 
but it went in and out of Byron Buxton's glove. Um, but it scored a run, so hey, we'll take it. We need those. <clears throat> it looked like a home run too off the bat. <laughs> I was like, holy crap, you had a home run. <laughs> that would have been better. Right. That would have been a lot better. <laughs> but whatever. We'll take what we can get. Yeah. What's the point? Was that Max Kepler that missed? I thought it was Max Kepler, actually. Oh, yeah. It was It was Kep- Kepsler. Whatever. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Um, I yeah. Buxton center field. <laughs> yeah, Buxton center field. My bad. I got it mixed up. Um but Avicel Garcia, he went two for five. He looked good. He's been looking good. I'm glad to see that. Yeah. Um, Travis Shaw, returning to Milwaukee, looked really good. He went two or two for four. Um, he also got walked. <laughs> he didn't strike out once, which is actually really promising. Cause he's usually clutched, and he looks a lot. Like the seventeen eighteen Travis Shaw, not the twenty nineteen Shaw. <laughs> yeah, twenty nineteen Shaw we don't want. Twenty eight seventeen and eighteen Shaw we needed, and we are look so far getting it. I had my doubts. I had my doubts. I wanted Jed Jericho back, but I, to, I'm surprised he's not even on a team. Like I thought. Honestly, I thought the Brewers maybe would bring him back with alongside Shaw, but I guess not. <laughs> eh, whatever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yeah, Kane one for five. I mean, yeah. Um, Try a bit. Wrong. Yeah. Omar two for five. Look pretty promising there. He looks a lot better already than last year. <laughs> Urias didn't have a hit, but he also had some good defensive plays, which I liked seeing. Um, yeah, Vogelback didn't have a hit. Arcia um, scored the game-winning run with a little chopper that scored Kane from third. <laughs> yep, and then the pitchers didn't do anything, of course. Um, but yeah, um... That was opening day for us. We scored on a chopper, like you said. The Twins, um, Donaldson actually got hurt after the first at bat. He got hurt walking or running. Um, he was gonna be running to second, but after he made a turn from first, he started hoppling or he started like limping his way to second base and slowly walking, and he got pulled. Um, for the Twins, that is not good, as their core is aging. <laughs> um, no, Bruce is, like, what, 42 or whatever? <laughs> yeah, not good. <laughs> yeah, an older squad, no, yeah. <laughs> they got the Bomba squad going on. Kenta Maeda started. We got to Kenta early, which I like. Um, in 4.1 innings, we hit, we, uh, got six hits, Two runs, one earned, two walks, and five Ks against Kenta. Um, yeah, I like that. Um, if we could get a starter out before the fifth inning, I think that's a W. Um, and another thing that I said last time when we recorded this before is um, we had no errors today, which is big. And I think we're going to see more of that because if um, Colton Wong was a big-time pickup for us, he's going to be helping infield defense. Arias looks really good in the infield. Um, obviously, every game we're not going to have – or every game it's not always going to be zero errors. I mean, we can't be perfect throughout the whole year. Yeah. Um, but I think it's going to be a lot lower – because Keston's defense at second was horrible. Um, it was clear when he got called up and started playing. But Colton Wong's going to fix that defense. Um, Hero at first. At first I was like, is that a good fit? Are we going to trade Hero? Are we going to do something? What are we going to do? And then it worked out tonight, obviously. But in the future, I don't know. 
Um, apparently, he uh, Hero worked with um, <laughs> or had to wear Prince Fielder's first base glove in spring training, according to Bill Schroeder. Uh, Bill Schroeder. <laughs> he actually. <Yeah. laughs> so yeah, it takes it takes time adjusting from a position that you played for like a long time to a new position like first base. Now obviously it's like, oh well, it's just a new position. But, you know, now you gotta now you basically you gotta tear down the things that you've learned about playing second and then you gotta learn new posi- or new learn a new position in the infield. Like, it's a lot different. Second or first, you just have to catch the ball. Second, you have to pass it on time. And field it. But, I don't know. Um, I think that's going to be it. Um, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment, and peace. Yep.